part two of the 210 grain 30 caliber Acubon long range. This one was traveling at approximately just over uh, 1700 feet per second, under 1800, and this one was traveling at right around 3000 feet per second. Weight retention on the low velocity was 199.4. Uh, and on the high velocity was 92.2. That uh, block I shot the high velocity loading pretty much destroyed that block, so I didn't try to set the pieces up here. The overall penetration of that bullet, I did dig it out. It came into this block up at a slight angle. You can barely see where it pin line there and stopped there, and I pulled it out. Um, that one, 23 inches of penetration, that massive portion of the wound cavity to destroy the block was just past 9 inches into the block, and then good permanent wound cavity um, up until just shy of the 12 inch mark before it pin lined to its resting point at 23 inches. This guy um, came in the side of the block started its expansion at about two inches and it had penetrated into the other block and was lodged up in the corner um, with approximately 29 inches of total penetration you can see petals that it shed here shortly after penetration I found these bullets do shed just a few light petals here that's really not a, a problem and then that roughly three inch, just over three inch permanent wound cavity runs from that two inch mark almost to 11 inch mark where it pin lines and does the rest of its penetration. So I'd have to say at uh, the high end impacting at 3000 plus feet per second, this bullet uh, definitely will still perform and drop game. And at that um, pushing far beyond uh, any ethical hunting ranges, this bullet would still have enough velocity and energy out of my 300 wind mag to drop any huntable game in North America. So overall, um, been thoroughly impressed with this bullet. I have found that this bullet, the 142 grainers out of my 6.5 Creedmoor, shooting those out of my Grendel and stuff to get that lower velocity um, perform all the way down to that 1300 feet per second mark that these this bullet line is rated to but I have found that these 210 grain uh, in the 30 caliber do need to be traveling a little bit faster some of my uh, earlier videos um, you can actually, if you pause in the right spot, about 50% of my low velocity rounds are tumbling through the gel and exiting. And the ones that I'm able to capture have next to no mushroom. So I sped them up a little bit to do this video and they performed in incredibly well.